Welcome back, you guys. How you all doing today? As this asshole is talking, I'm gonna try and beat him. Unfortunately, I thought I was gonna start from the very beginning, but I did not have such luck. You know what, though? I'm okay with that. I think I found a way to beat him. I noticed how there are several of these multiple uh, extinguishers and cans and everything throughout. So I'm gonna see if I can throw them at him, you know? I think that's a good way to beat him. I don't know, you know. Ah, I missed. Well, let me go ahead and try to go downstairs real quick. Without him getting to me. Where is he at? There he is. Want him to shoot me. Oh wow, I beat him! Sweet! So I did take enough damage off of him before. Oh snap, yes! Just a minute in, oh my god, I'm so happy. <laughs> you don't know how annoyed I've been trying to wait to play this game just so I could do that. Oh yes. Don't yes. die on me yet. This Boy Scout's got a few questions to ask. Your leader, the one who called you Barrett. Who is he? Why is FEMA sending you after Seraph Industries? FEMA? <laughs> you think FEMA gives a rat's ass about some rinky-dink biotech corporation's company secrets? <laughs> you got worse enemies than FEMA. Yeah, like who? Who? Get to Shanghai. Ping shot court gardens. <laughs> In house. Tell him. <coughs> Tell him. Don't die on me. Tell him Baron sent you straight to hell. Oh, snap. Oh, shit, son. The burns. The burns Jason, are what's real. What's going on down there? Those soldiers just sticks out like you wouldn't believe. They see you. No, I was flying dark in case it got hot. You all right? I'm fine. Patch me to Seraph. I'm getting you out of here first. Get to the LZ. I'll pick you up there. Woo! Finally, I beat him. Was this stuff at? Wait, what's up? what's in here? Oh, shotgun! Sweet. Anything else I could use? Anything else? Oh, well, we can hack it. I got enough hack level now. Yeah, let's go activate you. Let's go to you. Go to you. I don't ever worry because there's no one that can stop me from getting in here. Let's Access go. Grant. Let's go, baby. It's in here. I guess that won't work. Ooh, oh, no, nope, just fans. You would think there'd be something good in here. Oh, snap, music. Oh, what's in here? Level two, not a, not a problem at all. So much stuff. No, I don't think I can do it. Access. Yay, break. last second. Boom, baby. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff. Wow, I could have used all of this stuff. Bruh, are you serious? Are you seriously serious right now? I didn't even go below for that, though. Oh, next proxy is 365. I, uh, man, I'm really upset. Is there 
anything else in here that I need to find. So that's the entrance, and he's dead. Good for it, you douchebag. So that's 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 about it in here, I guess. Yeah, that, that's about it. I think that I could have used the sentries to hack it because I didn't have any of those items left. Reload! Thank you, music, for going away. Shotgun, let's reload. Good douche. Next up, the combat rifle. Next up, pistol is already charged. And now, this shoddy. Deactivate the hole, what? Kind of a sh shoddy, I guess. Is there anything out here? I guess not. Gang leader, I'll take your gun. Oh! Man, I Who's up. over there? Take your gun. Uh. Uh. I guess I have to kill him too. Sorry, bro. It is nothing personal. <laughs> nothing personal at all. I just want their guns. Jeez, how much did he have? These guys had a lot of stuff. I should have been loaded. <sighs> Revolver and shotgun shells. Okay. You ready to get out of here, Jensen? Yes, let's go. Yeah, take us back to Seraph Industries. None too soon, if you ask me. Strap in and hold on. Yeah, buddy. Oh God, it feels so good. And to think that I was literally that close to beating him that last time. I don't understand. I had him. But I just, I goofed him just quick. But you know what? Not again. Never again. Then again, I should have figured I was shooting him in the face for a while. And then he started using a lot of grenades. Only assholes do that. God, I got you my brake pads too. Man. Ooh. I need to speak with you. Meet me in your office right away. I loved you, Francis, but I have to debrief Sarah first. I suppose you could, or you could hear what I have to say and see if that doesn't change things. Pritchard out. You know, people have been talking about these kind of things ever since I was a kid. But to actually find evidence, to know the people running this country distrust us so much, makes you wonder if they really did close Guantanamo. <laughs> you know, people have been talking about these okay, kind of things. Okay, that's it. You got the same stuff to say. Yeah, I know. So hush. All right, let's go talk to Pritchard first, cause that guy's awesome. We need everyone on high alert. It's not only the pro ops you might want to get attacked. A secret prison camp hidden in Highland Park? You've got to be kidding me. That's what Where? You just kicked me out of his office, saying you didn't have time for stuff. Should go up the stairs then. No, shouldn't I? Yes, I should. Do respect, Mr. Cannon. I can't believe we're letting that arrogant bastard Taggart sniff around our building. Don't deny my fuels, but there was just something about Taggart that I thought. What do you want? As much as I hate to admit it, I need your help. That signal you shut down in DRB territory. It's been active for almost a year. You're telling me someone outside this company has had access to our network since before the first attack? I've detected intrusions before and shut them down swiftly every time. But whoever designed this particular algorithm is good. Very good. You've told Seraph? See, here's the thing. The intrusions were possible because of a backdoor access into our security system 
that I never even knew existed. The one Sanders team used to get inside our plant. I've worked here for seven years, Jensen, and this is the first time I've seen that particular access route. David Sarif created it, specifically to bypass the firewall. He's hiding something, and I think you should find out what it is. Yeah, it's got him getting money. Because, as far as I can tell, Sarif created that access and was streaming a lot of data through it shortly after your ex-girlfriend suggested he hire you. Bruh. Some serious stuff going on. Hey, painkillers. Gotta love it. Let's go upstairs. As soon as I go inside. There. Now let's go inside. I think we're going up. I'm not sure. Yep, we're going up. Hey, Excuse sir. Me. Mr. Jensen, isn't it? Sir, you have that charity dinner? In a moment, Isaiah. I was hoping I might run into you, Mr. Jensen. Bill Taggart. The founder of the Humanity Front. I know who you are. Yes. Yes, I imagine you do. As David Sarah's top security man, I imagine you have quite the file on me. But I assure you, Mr. Jensen, I am devastated by recent events. Really? I do not support what you and your company are doing to mankind. I believe it's extremely dangerous. But abolishing human enhancement technologies will only be achieved through legal means. I'll keep that in mind. This is your first day back since the accident six months ago, isn't it? Sir, we have to go. What happened to me was no accident. Ah, oh, my mistake. But it must have been stressful facing down a second incident so soon. I imagine it brought back all kinds of unpleasant memories oh no no there's no thing none of your damn business taggart did i hit a nerve forgive me it's my nature as a psychologist i suppose to want to ask the difficult questions you see i find that ignoring them doesn't make them go away i want to kill him you so might bad. want to keep that in mind now if you'll be so kind as to excuse me not just yet. You got a lot of balls coming here. After your followers attacked our plant. What makes you think you'd be welcome? They were not my followers, Mr. Jensen. The Humanity Front is a peaceful organization. Radicals have no place in it. Right. Do you know why I formed this organization? Because I saw a technology about to run rampant. You yourself seem to be living proof of it. I'd be dead without these enhancements. I understand that. I also understand that on an individual level, these issues can be complicated. But we must look beyond our personal interests if we are to see mankind survive the next century. We'll survive, all right. With or without your condolences. Hmm. I'm glad we had a chance to talk, Mr. Jensen. Wanna, wanna... Meeting you has been very informative. I guess I can't kill him. Dang it. Athena, you've been at this company a long time. I hope that's not a comment about my age, Adam. No. But I know nothing gets by you. If Sarif had done something that could compromise us. Mr. Sarif has only the best interests of this company in mind, Adam. I'm not questioning that. Aren't you? I've been here since the beginning. I've seen how he built this up from nothing. He cares for his people. He truly believes what we're doing is important. And he would never do anything to jeopardize it. That's what a crazy follower would do. No, you shouldn't have. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm busy. Fine then, you dumbass. I'll kill you. Oh, I got my, oh, my gun. Don't go below me yet. Yay! No, I want to do the, uh... No, not the health recharge. The inventory. Actually, let me check now. Boom, baby! Ooh! What's this? Oh, yeah, okay. Crossbow arrows? Do I have a crossbow? I don't have a crossbow yet? 
do I get that stuff for then? Energy pack. Cool. I don't really need the wine. This is some of robot. Boss, we need to talk. Is something wrong? I'm not sure. Did you set up a private access route to bypass the company firewall right before you hired me? Like <laughs> what? Pritchard said someone's been using it to access our system since before the first attack. The security measures he and I set in place never stopped them because we didn't even know the loophole existed. Oh, I see. Frank's fixed that though, right? He has now, but he's wondering why you never mentioned it. Frank's paranoid, Adam. Oh, God. You know that? Can a busy man forget things once in a while? You streamed an awful lot of data through that portal, boss. Right before you brought me on board, Preacher made me paranoid, but I gotta admit, I'm wondering what was in it, too. Yeah, as an ex-cop, I guess you would. But the important thing is, you found the hole and plugged it. We're secure now. And the information you uncovered in that FEMA acceptable. facility may actually help us track these guys. So let's just stay focused on what's important. I want to, believe me. I want to catch these guys as badly as you do. But that breach is responsible for every security crisis we've had, including today's. If you want me to stop these guys, I need to know what kind of data they've had access to. Yes, I do. You're right, you're right. I'm sorry if I seem evasive. The truth is, I've had a lot of other things on my mind. I'm trying to secure a future here for all of mankind. I can't let trivial security concerns get in the way when people like Bill Tagger want to see me fail. No, you're my best warrior, Adam. And I, and I trust you. I know the loyalty you've shown me will only continue as we take this fight into the future. Because that's what's really important, isn't it? The future. Bruh, don't try to be elusive. Boss, I think we're getting sidetracked here. If you want me to win this war for you, I need to know how badly we've been compromised. I need to know what was in that data stream, in case our enemies accessed it. You think they could have? I see your point, son. That might be bad. They keep making me look at his arm. Look, I'm not gonna share every single detail of this data with you. As CEO of this company, there are things I can't release, even to you, Frank, or Athena. I consider us all a team here, but we each have our own roles to fill. I decide who gets trusted with what, and in this case, you're just gonna have to do your job without knowing all the facts. Megan said you could roll with the punches. Proof she was right. Dude, don't you do this. Megan? Boss, what does Megan have to do with any of this? I thought we were discussing a security breach. No, Adam. You were discussing it. I just told you it's time to move on. Uh, no. Not gonna happen, buddy. Seriously. The data I streamed is not gonna hurt anyone. It was just some routine background information I needed to get familiar with after a discussion I'd had with Megan one night. It's the kind of stuff I look at all the time, and if someone did get a hold of it, they wouldn't know what to do with it. I'm telling you, we're fine. Doesn't trust seem me. like we're fine. We were attacked. I would like nothing better than to trust you with this, boss. But trust is a two-way street, and the way you've handled this entire conversation so far makes me think that it's you who isn't trusting me. Why, boss? What is it you're so afraid to tell me? Adam, of course I trust you, son. You better get the hand away from me. And it's not that I'm afraid to tell you the truth. It's just that, honestly, I'm afraid you'll take it the wrong way. Dude, what the hell All are you right. talking about? Look, the truth is, I set up a confidential data channel for a private investigator, someone who can run covert background checks on people, potential new recruits like you. You what? I had to, Adam. 
You were a liability, remember? You'd just been fired from SWAT. Now, Megan believed in you, but I had to be sure. Look, I don't want this to come between us. I'll send the files to your computer. You can see for yourself what he dug up. But Adam, you'd better be sure. Why? What do you mean? I mean, sometimes the past should stay in the past. Once you see that data, you can't unring the bell. When you're ready, come back and talk to me. We need to discuss our next move. Shoot. There's a lot of exposition in this game play. I couldn't uh, do much talking, but you know what? That's okay. I'm going to pause it here and continue it in a few moments. See you later, guys.